Look at these little uh, spooky, spooky uh, hand towels. This one glows in the dark. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to get me one of these too. Dead and breakfast in. Love it. I have to get that one. And uh, skeleton key arts and uh, and antiques. Everybody, come check it out. Keep calm and carry a wand. This place is awesome. Holy crap. He uh, built this. He sold it. He had passed away and his daughter sold it. And it, they made it into a funeral home. Oh, and man. And then it was a funeral home for 90 years. And then they ran out of space and they built a new location. This is un... Sat empty for a couple of years. And then my husband and I bought it. And we actually wow. we live upstairs. We've raised our family upstairs. Oh, that is so awesome. In a funeral home. <laughs> so have you had, you had anything kind of crazy here or... He's nothing, threatening to nothing. make something up because yeah. everybody wants there to be cool stories. And, well, I'll tell you a story about that, too. The house I'm sending the Biderbeck house. Oh, And yeah. I'm begging for something to happen. There's nothing there. There's yeah. nothing. She even told me. She said, Sean, there's nothing here. So I think... All right, everybody. This is Sean with Suncoast Films. I'm at the Rock Island. It's called the Skeleton Key Art and Antiques. And she was just telling me that this is a 90, former 90-year-old 90 funeral home. And uh, we're just going to walk around for a few minutes and show you around. And... Uh, uh, thank you so much for letting me do this. This, this is amazing. So we're going to take you with me here. A lot of history in this house. A lot. So let's walk. Let's do this. Look at these right here. Look at those. And uh, exactly what I would expect. I mean, look at the babies up there. So let's, uh, let's walk around for a minute, man. This is, uh, this is pretty freaking cool, man. What are you thinking here, man? This is... All right. Art and antique. So for a, a 90, look at that right there. So for a 90 year old, uh, 90 year old uh, funeral home. Are you kidding me right now? Look at this place, man. I'm shooting vertical because I just, uh, it just shows more detail. And uh, actually, I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and flip it back over to, to uh, horizontal here in a second. Look at all the, the pumpkins right here in the, look at that right there. A little cat right there, and uh, I'm gonna keep walking. Some more pumpkins and Halloween stuff right here. Look at that! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Little vampire right there. This is a little treat because I just left the Paracon and I just saw these doors open, and uh, and uh, that's really cool. A lot to see here. I'm getting up to head back to the Biderbeck house, and uh, and uh, just gonna kind of walk around. So it's kind of like an antique store. And it's also kind of like, uh, has a lot of art and things in it. Let's see what we can find here. Some more uh, Halloween themed things. Look at this. And a little, uh, little bassinet right here. Little thing. Oh, look at this. Look at that. And uh, this is really cool. What a treat, man, to get to see something like this. The fact that this was a 90-year-old funeral home just intrigues me. And and she said there's, I mean, I don't know, there could be some activity here. Uh, her, her dog just passed away, and I feel so sorry for her. So. And uh, see what they got over here. Here's some books and things. Oh, I bet that is so good. Pizza and dipping sauce. Grandma roses. I wish I could take some of this stuff back. I'm just, I am flat. I can't take it. I can't pack anything else. And, uh, I may see if, uh, blind date with a book. All right, continue walking. Look at the witch right here. This is pretty cool. And you see the, the oh, look at that. Look at that mirror right there. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, that looks so cool. And the monkey right here. There's just so much to see. Just gonna keep walking. That got a little lamp right there. I got something like that too. I'd like to see that. Let's keep walking around. This place is amazing. Look at some of the some postcards right here. Oh, that is really neat. So, so did you name it Skeleton Key? Oh my gosh, you did great. You did great. 
you got some really cool stuff. If I if I could pack, if I had room and I don't, I'm just doing carry-ons. But if I could pack, oh look at that back in the back right there. It's kind of spooky. If I could have packed, uh, I saw that dipping sauce, that pizza and dipping sauce. Oh my god, it's the best. Oh my god, I may have. How much longer are you in town for? Uh, I'm leaving tomorrow. So the that is actually the dipping sauce that they use at a pizza and calzone place here in town called Pizza and Subs. Do you ship? I don't. Dang. I'm not set up with the capacity to do it. Well, I may. Me. <laughs> well, I may have to make a trip back up here then. Yeah. Uh, this is. Thing, if you get a chance to eat a pizza and stuff before you go, the food's fabulous. Yeah, I, that I saw that. I was. I said dipping sauce. I was like, yeah, this yeah, is good. It's so good. This is amazing right here. This is a light, uh, a light yeah, switch. Yeah, that's made by a gentleman out of Downport. Um, wow. Yeah. He does all kinds of cool stuff. He actually does that, and he does stained glass work. He's well, a really multi-talented guy. And that's an actual switch that, that works, huh? Yeah, they all work. Somebody has way too much talent. So, yeah, they... Oh, like, like an old shipboard uh, yeah. light or something. Yeah, he just puts up... Could that is awesome. Elevator. It would have been like an elevator switch of some sort. Mm-hmm. So. Got all the conduit there in the boxes. Yeah, yeah he's a guy. <laughs> this place is awesome. And look at this one here. It's one of those transformer covers. It's got the little thing. I, I could totally, I could totally see this in my house. Look at the base on it, and they put the towel button. Then I got a few of these here from Poor Richard's Antiques. That is so cool. Love it. There's some more. Uh, candles and things like that. I'm really, really digging that pizza sauce. Ah, oh, here's another one. That is so cool. Yeah, somebody's got some talent, man. Here's the... Uh... Wow. This smells so good over here. Doesn't it? Oh my god. So those are all made right here in the Quad Cities too. Yeah, I see the uh I see the tags on them. Yeah. Wow. Super multi talented family. You got you <laughs> got that right, man. From that <laughs> as well. Yeah, Quad Cities right here. This is amazing. I may have to go get me a pizza before I leave. <laughs> They're it's so good. Yeah. They're calzones. There's uh, one of their calzones has um eggplant on it. If you like eggplant, they I do. actually bred the pieces of eggplant in house. To put inside the calzone. Someone told me to get a to get it to get a Quad Cities pizza. Yeah. It's, it's a different type of uh, different type of thing here. Yeah, yeah. It's chair right here. Style. Well, I just may do that because. Uh, you should. I'm trying to think where else. Have you been to the Arsenal Island? I did. I got some stories to tell you. Yeah, there's some. <laughs> Hi, how are you? This is this is really cool. What a treat, man. Not every witch lives in Salem. Where are you, Betsy? So, we'll walk back here real quick and some more Halloween stuff. Then, then, then we're going to get going. But I, I'd stopped in, man, from the... Uh, here's another one right here. Oh, my goodness. Look at this right here. Does it push in? Yeah, that's pretty cool, man. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. So, all right. All right, everybody, it's Sean with Suncoast Films at the Skeleton Key Arts and Antiques in Rock Island. We just left the uh, Paracon. I had to come in here, and uh, she's very nice, and uh, let, me, let me tour this place. This is really cool. So take care, everybody. I'm going to be heading back to the house now and uh, figure out what I'm going to do for dinner, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Later.